Hello friends, today we have our uh, third recipe for in a lunchbox series and it is going to be vegetable quesadilla and here I have all the fresh vegetables, the tortilla, cheese, onions and all the spices that we would need to make the tortillas. I cut them um, into small pieces as I would need and I'm just uh, cleaning up the space and uh, to the pan add a little oil and to that once the oil gets hot add a little bit of uh, onions, do not add too much of onions. Kids will not like too much of onion, so just add a little bit for the flavoring in the oil and um, saute it a bit. This is cumin going to that, a little bit of cumin. Uh, this uh, cumin and oregano and uh, paprika, these give the flavor of the Mexican um, the cuisine. So I just add a little bit of oregano to that and uh, saute it well, let the onion cook a bit. Uh, I want onion to cook more than any other vegetables there and here goes the red bell peppers you can uh, use any color bell pepper I chose to use the red here and um, so saute it a bit do not overcook it but I just wanted the raw um, thing of the vegetables to be gone if it's overcooked I, I mean I don't know how it's going to be even we can add it uh, uh, uncooked but uh, it may be very crunchy so here goes the mushrooms the vegetables are completely your choice. You can add your choice of vegetables. I chose to use um, the ones that I'm using here. These are some uh, mushrooms and some cilantro to that. And also these are some spinach. As I said, it's completely optional. The vegetables, uh, you use what your children would like. And I wanted to incorporate more vegetables to the lunch box. So I just added all these veggies. And here I have some black beans, which I got out of a tin. Uh, take a little bit, rinse it and then I put it in the little bowl and I mashed it with my hands and there it is and here goes the tortilla on the pan. Uh, here we have to heat the tortilla nicely so that um, it the, everything inside that it melts, whatever we add inside it melts. So make it hot, not warm, just make it hot and for the mixture we can make it a day before the vegetable mixture, we can make it a day before and leave it in the refrigerator put it in the microwave and then just assemble the quesadilla before we pack the lunch the next morning. And here to the warm tortilla goes the cheese. This is um, the Mexican cheese, the three cheese type. And um, here I have the, I'm adding the black beans to that and the sauteed vegetables. And just I'm adding to half portion of the tortilla. And if you want to make more pieces, more pieces, just make it all over. Like just spread the, have the spread all over the tortilla and just cover it with one other tortilla and let it cook on both the sides. And then you cut it. So that way we'll have more uh, pieces also. Like I mean, you don't, you don't have to make it twice. So you can just make it that way. Here I'm just filling it half the way. And um, I have topped it with um, cheese also again. And I'm adding the sauce. I did not like the sauce, but this is all I had. So I'm just adding it. And here, let it um, sit in the tawa for a few minutes. As I said, let it get really hot so that uh, the cheese melts and it holds all the vegetables together. So when the children pick it, it won't fall apart. The vegetables will be stuck to the cheese and it will be nice and um, I mean, it will be easy for the children to pick and eat. Uh, so and even with the cheese and with the vegetable mixture and all the sauce and everything it is really yummy definitely your children would love it and here here it is ready now it's quite hot i took it off from the pan and um, and now to the fruit choice i have gobas and uh, here here see I have cut them and um, you can see the vegetable and the cheese mixture it's holding it well and it will be very easy for the children to pick and eat. So this was a little bigger piece so I just uh, cut it a little bit with a pizza cutter over again but uh, make it into a nice triangle with just this time I missed it. And there it is and um, to the fruit here is guava I found some nice guava in the Indian store this weekend so I just picked some for my for myself. And here it goes. And then on the side, I add a little bit of sour cream. I did uh, uh, top it with some of the, the, the sauce that I had. Do not use it. If your children like it, um, just as it is, just give it um, like a sour cream itself. If you don't need any other sauce. And this is a lunchbox for the day. Hope you all like this recipe. 
I'll see you all again with a new recipe tomorrow. Do give it a try at home. I assure your children would definitely like it. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.